What's up, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot, and in this video, we're going to be going through some simple fixes for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, not saving settings when you close and restart the game. What happens sometimes is your game is looking super blurry, you go into the settings, fix the render resolution, and the next time you start up the game, it's set back to 40% or whatever it was before. If you're repeatedly having the issue where settings don't save, then this video is for you. We're going to outline a couple of different methods that should help you fix it. First of all, we'll be checking Windows Anti-Ransomware and we'll make sure that controlled folder access isn't stopping Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War from writing to the actual settings file. To do this, we'll simply disable it, check to see if it works, then re-enable it and add an exception for it. All that you have to do is hit start and then type in RAN. Click on Ransomware Protection and inside of this new window, simply make sure to turn off controlled folder access if it's on. If it is on and you're using it for something such as protecting your device from ransomware, which is probably recommended and turning this off solves the settings not saving issue then make sure to turn it back on click allow an app through controlled folder access click yes when prompted for admin and then simply click add an allowed app then click browse all apps and navigate across to where the game is installed if you aren't able to find it, simply locate Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War inside of your Blizzard launcher, click the options, and then click Show in Explorer. This will open up the folder with another folder inside of it, and this is where we'll be navigating. For me, the game is inside of D, Blizzard, Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. When you find it, simply double-click on the launcher EXE as such, then click Add an Allowed App, Browse All Apps, and we'll also be adding the main game EXE, Black Ops Cold War .exe. After adding both of these EXEs, we've now allowed them through the controlled folder access, meaning they can access files on your PC without issue. Note that you only have to do this if you want controlled folder access to be on, and it was on before this whole process started. If for some reason ransomware protection was off by default, or it didn't help fix your issue, then there's something else that we can do. Let's try resetting your graphics settings through the actual files so that it regenerates everything, and if there's an issue with it saving, it should be able to get through it. Hold Start, and press E to bring up a new file browser dialog. Inside of here, head across to Documents, followed by Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, and then locate the Player folder. All we're going to do is either rename this or delete it. I prefer to rename it in case something goes wrong. So I'll simply just add a 1 to the end of it or something. The next time the game starts up, it won't be able to find this config folder with all of the settings inside of this config file, meaning it'll regenerate everything into a new player folder over here. And if there was some issue with the file, it should be fixed now. If for some reason you're still not able to save settings, then there's something else we can do. When you're playing the game, simply choose the settings you want, save, then close the game and open up the battle.net launcher. We'll click the Blizzard icon in the top left and then click exit. After doing this, we'll restart the Blizzard launcher and we'll start up the game once more. This time, don't touch your mouse or keyboard until you reach the main menu, shaders have compiled and you're ready to start playing the game. Sometimes this can solve the issue that you're having. If for some reason your game is still not saving settings between launches, simply change everything you want in game, then close out of the game you can leave the Blizzard launcher open this time. Once the game is completely closed and you've already changed your settings, simply hold Start and then press E to bring up a new file browser dialog. Head across to Documents and once again open up Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Then we'll be opening up the Player folder and we'll locate config.ini. You can double click on it and edit some of these settings if you want manually from here. Usually I'd turn off intro movies, set the correct resolution, refresh rate, etc, etc. Once you're happy with all of the settings inside of this file, right-click config.ini, then click Properties. Inside of this new window, simply make sure that Read Only is checked. Apply. OK. The next time you start up the game, it can only read from the settings file. It won't be able to save a new settings into this file. Note that this will disable your settings menu in-game, i.e. you'll change settings, you'll close the game, restart it, and absolutely nothing will have changed from the previous time you launched the game. Why? Well, simply because we've locked the actual config file over here. I'm not exactly sure if this has anything to do with it, but inside of the folder, inside of this player's folder, if you have one, there's also a config file here. You can also try the same, making this file read-only as well. By doing this, you're making sure that the settings won't be changed by the game and can only be changed by you when you want them to change. Assuming at some stage in the future the game comes out with an update, there's new graphics options, and you want to change them. Simply locate the same file, right-click, Properties, and then make sure to uncheck Read Only, Apply, OK. That last solution is sort of an end-all solution. It's pretty difficult to go ahead and change settings after that, as you need to remember where that file is to begin with. But besides that, hopefully your game is successfully saving settings. My name is Techno, but here for Troubleshoot. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!